cousins hey 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 how's everybody's day i'm sitting outside y'all having a glass of wine and it is chilly chilly bang bang out here so i don't plan on being out here long how's everybody everybody feeling good nice i started a new job y'all and compared to what I was doing, this position right here is butter. Do you hear me? Like butter. Like it's just so freaking neat. Like it's it's neat. Not to mention my night is going much faster. I'm not there as late as I was before. And actually, I'm home at the time the 12-hour shift would end. You feel me? I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Yeah, but I want to check in and let y'all know how this new thing going for me. But yes, I'm really loving it. It's going to be an adjustment because I used to work four, three days. Now I'm working four. Not to mention if overtime is required, there's five. If you ask me, less is best. That's just what it is for me. Like... If I ain't got to work four and five days, then honey, bunches, let me tell you. I'd rather not, for real. Like, but you just got to do what you got to do. You got to do what you got to do. Is it chilly, chilly, bang, bang, where y'all at? Mm. One minute, you got to flip-flops on and a jacket. The next minute you need a coat, a hat. You don't want to put the gloves on because you don't want to think you snowman out here, but uh, keep it close. For real, it's just crazy how the temperature drop compared to just, what, two days ago? Oh my gosh, but when that sun come out, you already know where I'm at. That's where life begins, you hear me? But yeah, glass of wine in the cool weather. I just got to have the air. You hear me? Like, I love to be in the air. Like, mm, it's just so serene to be outside, especially with nobody out. Neighbors. They're not out here, whatever. Mm, who else like nature? I know somebody. I know some of my cousins like nature. I know y'all do. Mm, that's what's up. I didn't even do nothing to this head yet because... You know, it's always something to do. You feel me? And I'm just not certain on how I want to style it or whatever. But um, as y'all know before, I said I like ponytails. So that's probably what it's going to be. Yeah, I, I do want my ponytails back. Oh, y'all like my hat? My sister made this hat. Nice, right? It's a scarf that goes to it, but... Um, I didn't think I need the scarf to shut y'all. The hood is doing it for now. But yep, you know, to, you know, my mornings are my nights because when I get in, that's nighttime. That's my nighttime because I go in late, come in home early or whatever. So let's have an evening glass of wine. <laughs> yep, evening glass of wine. All my cousins who are mothers, happy Mother's Day, y'all. Happy Mother's Day. I pray that y'all had an awesome sauce day. And you was treated as you deserve to be treated. Mm hmm Because mothers, like, you can't go to school to perfect that. You feel me? There's no degree. It's just, you know, uh, you learn as you go. And you raise them to the best of what you know you feel me but it's a phenomenal experience raising children you feel me like phenomenal and the um it's like when you raise your kids and then they remind you mom i remember when you did x y and z or we couldn't do this that and the other it just make you feel good because you know they mindful of how they was raised or the things that you did you feel me like with my kids, I didn't allow them to grow up fast. 
you know, with girls, girls can be sassy and want to do X, Y, and Z at the early ages. I, I went with none of that. My son, thankfully, he didn't like hanging with gangs and a bunch of people. He was a soloist. soloist. He's just like stayed to himself. So thank God for that. But yeah, you know, it was stages of my daughter's life. Like they couldn't do, they couldn't. They couldn't have, none of them could have company stay the night. That was just like a, well, I, I, let me take that back. They could have people stay the night, but they couldn't stay over nobody else's house. It, I'm just saying, like, I just, if I can't see, then it, it won't be. You hear me? And, um, the girls, like, you know, you gotta be a little, a little stern with your girls, because, honey. But, yes, they, um, they just they had stages you know different stuff that they can do when they was a certain age like they didn't get cell phones until they was a certain age you know kids got cell phones now and they like five four and five years old and honey don't think they don't know how to work them because they do that's the crazy part that's why i can't see myself raising a child now because to be honest they be super little and appear to know more than you know. You feel me? We're not having that, honey. Mm -mm. Yes, my kid, my girls couldn't wear hair color until they was like mm, 16. Yeah. No hair color until they were 16. They can tell y'all more about the stage than I can. You know what I'm saying? Like, they remind me. They remind me all the time what they couldn't, couldn't do, what they could and couldn't do. But it feels good, you know what I'm saying? Because you don't want to always give your kids everything they want. You know what I'm saying? They need to know that you're deserving of X, Y, and Z when you are. Or you're just not old enough for this, that, and the other. You feel me? It's okay to say no, like. But yes. All the mothers. Much love to y'all. There is nothing that compared to motherhood. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's a top-notch job right there. Like, <sighs> phenomenal experience it really is like it's, it's not easy by stretch you hear me not easy by stretch but yeah I just think about the fact that I raised these kids and it's like mm, mm, mm. I'm grateful that none of them are on drugs you feel me my daughters they had children at a young age you feel me like but um they pretty pretty they they pretty level you feel me they didn't try to put their kids on me you feel me like because for one i wasn't going, going to keep them i don't do no babysitting love my grandkids with every fiber of my being but i don't babysit i just don't like it's just not what i do i don't have the patience for little people like when my children were little because little people today Aren't like, you know, kid, kids when my kids were little. They don't want to be talked to. They want to talk with you. You can say, well, you're not doing no more coloring because we ready to go eat. But I'm not finished coloring this circle right here and I was going to eat when I'm done. Too much talking see that kind of stuff that that requires patience you know what i'm saying you got to stop drop and roll think about what you're gonna say or do to this child before you know you find yourself oh uh, you gotta collect call from we're not even gonna go do all that so to avoid lack of patience honey bunches yes i, I can't do the babysitting thing i just can't nope nope nope, nope. which one of our cousins feel like that too i know everybody feel like that everybody don't babysit their grandkids Mm -hmm. Nope. But I used to feel bad though. I used to, oh, dang, I don't watch the babies. But then I thought about it. I said, when they come here with their mothers, I watch them. I watch them run and play and I watch them get in trouble because their mother said, don't do that or don't say that to your grandmother. I'm watching them. I'm watching them be disciplined. I'm watching them be cared for. All right. Yes, for real, like, mm -hmm. 
But I'm almost done my wine, y'all, and I wanted to sit with y'all while I drink it. I so appreciate y'all for listening to me. Coming up to say hi to me, cousins. I know y'all can't wait till I can go live. Mm, mm, mm.